Cervical spine injury is suspected in athletes. When a cervical spine injury is suspected in athletes, do not remove the helmet or the shoulder pads. Only the face mask should be removed in the event that access to the airway is needed. It's important to assess the player's vital signs. This should include checking the player's airway, breathing, and circulation. You should also check for eddy disability and do the necessary exposure of the patient to check for any other injuries. In preparation for transfer, movement of the injured player needs to be done in a stable manner in order to prevent further injury. If movement is required, a team of four to six people is needed. One person stabilizes the head while the others log roll the player supine onto a spine board. The head should be supported on each side by cervical support pads and strapped to restrict movement. The rest of the body is secured to the stretcher with three straps. These straps are needed to secure the torso, pelvis, and legs. Do not transport the player until a full assessment of the injuries have been done. All my videos and this video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.